this tutorial, we're going to talk about advanced editing, which is something I hope you never use because in the previous tutorial, I showed you how to edit your newsletter. But when it comes to this advanced editing, let me put it this way. You get paid a lot of money for listing and selling real estate, not for editing a newsletter. And we do all the heavy lifting for you. Everything's already pre-done within the template. So all you need to do is some minor tweaking. But that said, let me show you what I mean by the advanced editing. So here I am inside one of my documents slash newsletter and let me highlight this opening uh, text here at the top remember everything was in boxes so I'm gonna select the first box and I'm looking for the blue uh, drop down menu here I'll select edit now let me scroll down here and what I mean by advanced editing is this notice it says print background print border print margin and email settings all right well print background is actually the background that's underneath this box. But if I click on this box, now I've got different colors I can select from. So arbitrarily, I'm just going to pick yellow. All right, and I'll pick yellow and then I'll hit save and watch on the left-hand side what happens. And it's been updated. So what it's done is that entire box, remember everything works in boxes here, or blocks, sorry. That entire block has been turned yellow. Okay, so if you want something to stand out, cool, you can do that. And you highlight the various boxes to create that effect. So let me cancel that. Actually, what I need to do is highlight this box again. And then back space so there's nothing there now I hit save and everything goes back to the way it was all right so I was going to say hit the back button this one here but the back button or the undo only applies to changes that you've made in text not what you've made with uh, the background so print margin definitely stay away from that you know that's already being configured for how your printer works Print border, eh, I wouldn't really mess around with that, but if you want to, I mean, go crazy. But finally, this one here, email settings, export with email template. So what we do by default, let me just scroll down the page here. You can see the newsletter, when it's emailed, it's not going to send out the entire newsletter. We select specific blocks of text, and those are the ones that will then be emailed out for you. And you can tell which ones are going out by, remember here, let me hit the blue thing and I'll hit edit. And notice right here, this blue box is checked. So we know that this block is going out. Let's jump over here and select this block. Edit. And that one's going out. Well, let's find something that's not going out. Let's take this block and let's hit edit. Ah, and you can see here it's not checked, so that box or that block will not be going out into an email. So what you can do if you want is you can go through here and select which blocks you want to go out in an email. And once that's done, hit save, and that's what's going to go out. So again, this is advanced editing. It's stuff that I really hope you don't get into because your highest and best use of your time is, like I said, listing and selling real estate, not being an editor. And we, again, have done all the heavy lifting for you and just left it up to you to do some minor tweaking. So keep that in mind when you get into this advanced editing.